Welcome to Ely Cathedral, where here I am standing in front of the Christmas tree. One of the few things I suspect that won't be different this Christmas. These last few months have, for me, certainly focused my attention on things that are the, really the most important, who's doing the most important jobs in our lives. It's also focused and brought into sharp relief for me things like the divisions within our society and in our world and how going into the future we're going to make the best use of the world's resources. Somehow this pandemic has brought all that into much sharper relief. And it's also brought into sharp relief for me what Christmas at its heart is really about. I saw a Christmas card just the other day and it had on it just a very basic stable and above were the words, the first Christmas was very simple. We have in some ways sort of accumulated lots and lots of stuff around Christmas and all this time is bringing us back to what is simply at its heart. I think it's no accident that in his gospel, at the very beginning, St. Matthew says, the angel says to Joseph that the child is going to be called Emmanuel, God with us. And then at the very end of his gospel, he's the risen Jesus says to his disciples, I will be with you always to the end of the age. For lots of us, this time has been very much a period of downs rather than up. And it's my hope and prayer that through all of that, you may know that God is with you. God is with us. The Christmas message of peace and joy and hope that which the angels sang is summed up in that words of those words of Matthew's gospel. God is with us. May God be with you and all those you love this Christmas time and may his blessings be with you.